Greetings and salutations. It is Sunday, December 7th, and that means Christmas is almost here and I'm a little terrified, but this year I'm actually kind of on the ball. All of my presents are ordered and I'm in the process of making the rest of them. And we're only in the first week of December, so that's that's pretty good. I'm like I'm never this much on the ball, so I'm fairly excited. Uh I'm kind of cheating for presents though. Family members are getting uh photo books of our wedding cuz that happened. So I guess I'm cheating a little, but oh well. Makes things easier for me because we're in the middle of a move, kind of. So, speaking of move, we are moving in less than two months, and I am very, very, very excited about that. And yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Um, December is the second craziest month of my life. June is the craziest because of all of the <laughs> birthdays, anniversaries, uh, Father's Day shenanigans that go on in June, but December is equally crazy. So to explain, my side and my husband's side each celebrate Christmas twice. And usually before, before this year's kind of, the last couple years have been kind of less insane, but when we first started dating, especially the first like four or five years, it was four Christmases every year. And I lost my mind. It was two things on Christmas Eve, two things on Christmas Day, and neither were close together so they were always one was always in the afternoon one's always in the evening and they're usually like an hour apart for driving so that was always fun um my parents anniversary and my mother-in-law's birthday are on the 20th which is oh so exciting so that's always been crazy and it's just insanity and i get christmas is crazy for everyone but I'm sorry, four Christmases, one of which, with my husband's dad's side, is usually about 40 or 50 people, and they try and do that, uh, there's a lot of different names for it, Chinese gift exchange, white elephant gift exchange, uh, the stealing game, whatever you want to call it, they do one of those with, for like 40 or 50 people, and it's insanity, it, it, it's, it's crazy, and oh lord, it's, it's, it's just a gong show. Um, this year is the first Christmas that my parents will not be here. Um, it's the first Christmas I'm celebrating without my parents, which is going to be different. Um, so we're celebrating early with them. They are going to the States to visit my mom's youngest sister, who we don't really get to see for Christmas anymore since she moved. And so yeah, it's going to be different this year. And I'm fine with that. It's just different. I usually am okay with change. But it's different. So we'll see. Anyway, so that's all I really wanted to talk about today. Um, how long have I been yammering? Oh, three minutes. That's good enough. So yeah, Christmas. It's crazy. Um, let me know your Christmas traditions down below because I'm curious if everyone does a bunch of crazy random things like me or if you only ever do one big thing or one small thing or if you don't celebrate, what do you do for the two, for the two to three days off that you get? Do you like just go on a big drinking bench? Do you go to the mountains? Do you sit at home and play video games. That's what I would do if I didn't celebrate Christmas. I would stay home in my pajamas and play a lot of video games and drink a lot of tea. And it would be a good time. Anyway, thank you for watching. Tomorrow we will be back with the um, part three of our arena run with the Goblins vs. Gnome sneak peek. So you have that to look forward to. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.